Rosie. I think I finally finished my Christmas list. That's your Christmas list? How many things did you ask for? Oh, just 263 things. Just 263? I think you have forgotten the real reason for Christmas, Johnny. The real reason for Christmas? Why, Christmas is all about a vacation from school. Christmas trees and presents, presents, presents. Johnny, you've got it all wrong. I do? Yes. Christmas is the time of year when we remember that God gave Jesus to the world as a present. You mean Jesus was the first Christmas present? That's right. Jesus gives us everlasting life. You should be thinking about what you will give Jesus this year. What do you mean? What can I give Jesus for a present? The Bible tells us that any time we give to someone who cannot give back to us, it is like giving it to Jesus. You mean like giving to someone who is poor? Right. So you could give some of your money in your piggy bank to help a little boy or girl who doesn't have as much as you. Or you could ask Jesus to help you be a friend to someone who needs a friend. There are lots of presents you could give Jesus if you would think about it. Hmm. I'm going to start praying and asking Jesus to show me five presents I can give him this Christmas. I've already thought of one. All the toys I was going to sell at a yard sale, I'll give to a children's shelter. Oh, I thought of another. The next time Mom goes to the rescue mission to make sandwiches for the homeless people, I'll go with her and help her. Kids, have you thought of a present you could give Jesus for Christmas? We celebrate Christmas by giving because we remember that God gave his only son, Jesus, to be the Savior of the world. Bye!